on this beautiful Sunday afternoon. All right, guys, we're, we're changing it up. We do a lot of scrambles. We always do scrambles. We're doing an alternate shot today. We're doing an alternate shot. Our goal is to shoot three over par. You know, alternate shot's a little difficult, so we're giving ourselves a little leeway here. If we shoot three over par, we'll be happy. Anything over three over par, not 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 too good at all. So we're starting off on the par fours, 340 yards to 350, give or take a little. Teen off on the goals. We got the high school team on the white on the whites again, so not available. I'm going up first. Hit my driver. See how things go. Oh, wow, that's baby. nice, nice. Wow, that's in the middle of fairway and long. Oh, that's wow, good. good. That's a great <laughs> start. Okay, good okay, start. guys. Guys, you know what? I'm happy I put the three wood away and I took out the driver. Good choice. All right, guys. I'm up. Hey guys, walking down the fairway. Had a good day today so far. What did we, do? we didn't do much today. What did you do today, Dad? I cleaned my car. Cleaned his car. car. If you can guess the make and model of his car. It's not a car, it's a truck. Uh, oh, it's a truck. So you just gave it away. <laughs> well, you just said. You make can more. guess. Make... got to be honest with the people. Yeah, it's a truck. I think it's a truck. What did I do today? Oh, mow the yard. Got, to, got, the yard, got some yard work done today, oh, guys. Oh, you did some on that fertilizer. Yeah, you fertilized. And now we're out here playing golf. Yeah, teamwork. <laughs> we, we, we tackled the yard work together so we could get out here and get, get to play golf together. So. Here we go. Teamwork makes a dream work, baby. We're approaching our, my ball right now. Pretty good shot. Middle of the fairway. A little chip in. A little chip. Yeah. Oh, so. He hammered it. You're yeah. Ask for, you can't get a better shot than that. No. Started off good today. Hopefully we keep it that way, guys. All right, guys. I'll see you guys up at the ball. All right, guys. Approaching my shot right now. My dad's going to have to do a top flight today, unfortunately. Yeah, I, I was just thinking. I got to do a top flight. That's all. I, well, no, you, you know what? You pick. You can play the ball of your choice. We'll do that. No, we can't. I'm going to play the top flight. All right, you going to play the top flight? That's my ball, as you guys say, about 30 yards. Yeah, 30 yards to the green. Pins to the front of the hole. I mean, the hole. What am I trying to Pins say? in the front. Pins in the front of the green. My dad's up. What are you hitting? I'm going to just put a pitching wedge up there. Just right. a little pitching wedge to see if I can run it up there a little bit. All right, guys. Old man's up hitting a pitching wedge. See if you can get up close to the hole for me. There we go. Nice. All right, guys. Go ahead, roll it out. Roll that out. Roll out. That's what. That's what. That's what. I want to hit one. I want to hit the same nine just for the heck of it. I gotta say nine in my pocket. We're gonna try the difference. I'm completely fine. You play your ball. I play. My, there's no difference. There's literally no difference in that. Okay. I just so say, let's do that from now on. Say nine. I want to see what difference all works. As long as you put the ball exactly where my ball landed, there's no. There, you can do that. Look at say nine. Yeah, we're gonna take Look that one. Say nine. It's right next to the hole. Which? C9 is right next to the hole, didn't roll out right there. I want to show the difference. Yeah, guys, so we're, we're comparing golf balls today, too. That's another thing. Let's see you guys at the hole. All right, guys, since we just made the rule up right now that you can use your own ball, we have to play my ball, the top flight, unfortunately. But this is the difference. The, the top flight rolls out. The St. 9, this is the difference in golf ball. The St. 9, look at the difference. It didn't roll out, had a backspin to it, stopped nice. Top flight landed and it rolled out. Good putt. The green goes that way too, so it's rolling with the slope of the green. So with the the I used say to, nine landed somewhere around here, it stopped. And that, I wasn't that wasn't my best shot, but I mean it landed about somewhere around here and rolled. All right, see, I like the I like to say nine better. All right, guys, warm up. See if I can put it in for birdie. Oh, wow! You got part putt, old man. All right, Mike can start this off. All right, guys, not a good putt by me. Um, my putting was off this so far. Hopefully, the old man can sink that in. It's makeable. Should we'll make it. Boom, baby! Oh, we got away with par. Nice putt. Nice putt. Oh, okay, guess what? You ended off the last putt, so I get to drive off again. No, no, we're going to do it. Off in a shot. That's how we're doing it. No, no. All right, guys, we're in the fifth hole. My, my, we came with the ruling. My dad's going to tee off this one since I teed off last hole. Par five, dead straight ahead, about 500 yards. We have a beauty with us today, guys. We have a club that's older than my dad, and I don't know if that's even physically possible. Look at it. We have a, a uh, Wright and Ditson St. Andrews wooden club, wooden shaft, hickory shaft, wooden face. This wooden is a completely face. wooden club except for the, it's got a little metal plate there. Uh, it's got the leather grip. So we're going to try hitting it. Yeah, we see how it is. So see, see how far you can hit a wooden club that's over 100 years old. Let's try one of these. Hopefully we don't break it. I don't want to break it, that's for sure. Both profile one's almost like a three wood. The that's what I asked it. you when I first saw it. When I first saw I it, it's a driver though. I said, is this a driver or is this a wood? I don't think they had woods back in that day. Well, that flew pretty good. Well, you think it did pretty good. 
faded a little bit to the right, but he carried the bunker. There's one thing carry, but went to the right, but that's not bad. You want to try it? I always bring crappy balls with me, guys, in case if I want to test something out. I'm not worried about losing one of my really expensive top flights. Yeah, this is weird. There you go. You're right where I am. It was the right, but it's not bad. It's not bad. It gets up there. Not bad. Yeah. It's it didn't good. break, so it we're good. Break, so we're good. We're still going to get our money back on eBay. It makes it even. Everyone, want, everyone wants to tee off, so that's, that's fair, you know? Yeah. So my dad's teeing off par 5, about 500 yards, hitting the Titleist, hitting the St. 9. Cute Saint sauce. Nine. Let's get it going. Nice. Wow, you're not gonna look at that. <laughs> you're not gonna get any power in that's that. pretty darn good. All right, guys, I'm gonna show them up right now and drive a ball anyway. Wow, just to show it didn't them that. go anywhere. What do you mean it didn't go anywhere? It's, it's on. All right, guys, got some yards to make up. My dad had a good hit in the middle of the fairway, but it just barely, barely made the fairway. I don't, yeah, I think it's shortest fairway. I don't know, guys. It's, Came up out of it a little bit. Looked like it was going further than what it did. Yeah, he's, I thought first, it hit it good. When he first hit it, he started giggling like, oh, 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 look at how far it went. <laughs> it went nowhere. And then it died. And it died. Just like his golf game did. Yeah. All right, guys. I didn't make the uh, didn't make the fairway, but uh, Mike should be able to put us in good position. I think you hit that 100 yards, guys. Yeah, I hit that good, but it just died. I don't know why it died. But are we doing that rule? I can use my ball. If you want to hit your ball, sure, you can hit your ball. That's the rule we're gonna we're gonna make different rules here, guys. You need so much. You watch it. I'm putting the ball exactly where the old man's was. There you go. Let me see my ball. Hold on, it's a pinnacle. I don't. Oh, it's a top flight. Guys, I am a strictly top flight only guy. All right, so here you go. Hitting the three wood. I would use my Cleveland bunt, but I need some distance out of this. I'm, I'm hoping we can get it close enough to where we can get at least 100 yards out so we can get it on the green. Wow, you hammered it. You absolutely hammered it. Okay. Right, yeah, now it's up play. to me. We're in play. Good shot. Michael guys. did his job. Now it's up to me. All right, Still guys. That was a good part. shot. Walking up to our balls. Nice day. Or our ball, I should say. We're playing out in a shot. Free Willie. Free Willie. <laughs> so, here you go. You talk. I'll, I'll, I'll be the cameraman. I know. Well, you look at, look at the voyage. We're up in New England. The, the leaves oh, are yeah, changing. Guys. For you who do not live in New England, this is one of those boring states where you don't get you don't get seasons. Yeah, this is what we can be thankful for. We're thankful during the fall time, but winter time comes, we're we're sick of it. <laughs> yeah. A snowstorm yeah, or two. Got tired of it because we can't play golf. Yeah, but we uh, we enjoy. It. This is actually a really good time of year to play because you know everything's green, everything's everything is nice. It's still nice and uh, it's not too hot. And right now there's no leaves in the middle of the fairways, so we're able to find. Yeah, that's ball. another thing, guys. Up in New England. When the leaves start falling down, you get a ball in the middle of the fairway and you cannot find it. Because once the leaves start falling, whoo, it's hard to find your ball. Hey guys, I hit that really well. Um, there's the 150 marker right there. There's my ball about 30 yards up here. We're going to say 120 yards out. That's pretty good. I hit that real well, actually. I wanted to get about 100 yards out for my dad, so I'd say close enough. Wind's against us. Wind's so. against us, so he's already making up excuses why he's not going to reach the green. <laughs> But the wind is against us, so I will give him that. I would go with an eight. Okay. Guys, we have, my dad makes one of the best homemade lasagnas out there. Oh, it's good. Everybody it is it. really good. I'm not going to lie. He does make a very good lasagna. Mm -hmm. I think one of these times we're, we're going to do a, a homemade cooking, homemade lasagna with Frank. Homemade lasagna with Frank. <laughs> but then again, we can't, Frankie, give, Frankie. <laughs> we can't give away the recipe. <laughs> recipe is simple. There is no recipe. Hold on. Just do what tastes good. Yeah, exactly. It makes you happy. All right, hitting a nine iron, hitting 120. Nine iron. Pins to the front of the green. Yep. Nice. Perfect. All right, oh. we're up, guys. We're on. We're okay, on. we're good there. You can, right we're on the good front there. of the green. Good we're good there. Should use the top plate. All right, we, the controversy between a Saint Nine, which I like, and Mike's top flight. Yeah, the Saint Nine does not roll. If it was a top flight, it would roll down. Right now, we're on the edge of the uh, green. We've got a good opportunity for birdie, though. It's just, uh, certainly a makeable. You know what else would have happened, what? guys? If he used an eight iron, it might have made it a little bit farther on the green. Yeah, I didn't catch that nine. I think if I caught the nine, we would have been on. I didn't catch it. We still got a birdie putt. Got a good opportunity for birdie. See you guys there.
All right, guys, this is my dad. Dad shot it up right on that fringe of the green, top front of the green. I told him, should it, should it hit an eight iron, but he doesn't listen to me. Mike knows best, people champ. Taking my ball, giving his ball, so you guys see we're not moving it anywhere. All right, guys, going uphill. What do you think it breaks to, Dad? I don't know. This, this green is really funny. Uh, this is for birdie, so we can walk away with the par. That's our goal here, guys. We're shooting alternate shot. We haven't played this format in a long time. Our goal is to shoot par. Feels like it's got to go to the right. right. But this green is funny. It's It's been, I don't know. We'll see what happens. Just got to get it close so we can get a par out of this. We're trying to par it. That's going to go in. Come on. Oh. All right, we show the par. Boom, baby. Got the par. See? That's what it is. It took you St. Nine, guys. You got the par, guys. All right, so we're not playing bad, guys. The thing is, we're a team here. That's one thing with me and my dad. I'll have a bad shot. He'll carry it. I have a bad shot. He carries me. Or he'll have a bad shot. I'll carry him, so. That's why I like playing with my dad. We make a good team together. We support each other. And we have fun, so. We're heading off to the next hole. I'm gonna, I have the pleasure of teeing off. So we'll see you guys there. <laughs> Frank can't get the club in the bag. Let's see. Yeah, the, there we go. There Club's we in go. the bag. There, there we, we go. go. <laughs> All right, guys. Uh, right now, we're at even par. We're at even par, baby. Par even four, par. 360 yards. Dog hooked. What do you with it? Dog, dog leg? leg right. Dog leg right, right? Dog leg right. I'm coming up. Last time I hit it really good. I got up over those trees. That was like a once in a lifetime shot, though, so. Just trying to get it out there for my dad so he can get us uh, on the green. Nice. That's going to be. We're going to find out when we get up there. If that's cleared everything, okay, it's by that tree. Oh, we might have a tough shot here. Wow. Behind that tree. Okay. All right, guys, heading up there. I tried doing what I did last time. Last time I was able to drive it over those trees and uh, put it pretty close to the green. So. I tried doing it. I tried doing it. I tried doing it this time too. I got over the trees, but I don't know if I got over all the trees this time. Last time I got over all of them. I hit a little branch on the way down, but it didn't affect the play at all. So. Yeah, but, yeah I think we're gonna be able to play. But there's not much. There's not much in our way there. No. The only but, way we're not gonna be able to play is directly behind the tree. Yeah. Hopefully Definitely we're not directly good. behind the tree, but. I think I somewhat did what I wanted to accomplish doing what I did last time. So we'll see you guys up there. Hopefully my dad doesn't have that difficult of a shot. Because he's not playing good at all today. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm kidding. He's playing good. We're all both playing good today. <laughs> Alright guys, see you guys up there. Guys, I just told my dad to shut up. How rude of me. I'm yeah. kidding, I love him. Nice. Alright guys, this is my shot. up. I got it over those trees, which I wanted to. Last time I got it over these trees too. This time I landed in between them. So I left my dad a little bit of a tough shot. But we do have an opening. My dad just has to keep it low. We have an opening. We, we can reach the green. Let's see what he, what he hits and what he can do. Okay, I'm going to change Golf buddy, we're at least 150 to the hole. Put it on the golf buddy was okay, right here. There's a par four. We gotta get on here. We gotta get on here. If we don't get on, we'll chip and putt. Or at least close enough to where you can. There we go. Sit. Oh, yeah, great shot. A little far putt, but you know what? We got a chance for a par, or a chance for a birdie. We're on the green. On the green. Good job. Nice shot. I, I felt good. That felt good. Yeah, good All right, shot. guys. Give an idea what we're looking at here. I had a in between those two trees up there. See, there's that space because I could have branches. So I was fortunate enough to hit it in between those two branches on the back of the green. But hey, we got a chance for it. We got a chance. Yeah, we're on the green. You guys, you know why my dad made such a good shot? Because I put him in position <laughs> to make that shot. If I didn't put him in position of those two trees. He would have never had the opportunity to make a good shot. So <laughs> I would just have to make a your your dull ordinary shot. I had to put it between two trees because Mike put me in a bad position. No, no, no. It wasn't a bad position though. This course is pretty open, so I put him in a good position. Yeah, he put me in a good position. We're gonna rake this. What kind of animals here? That's a dog. Has to be a dog. Maybe a dog ran through it. All right, guys. So well, we actually have an opportunity here to. Uh, well, we always have an opportunity to make birdies, seems like, but these are long birds, a long birdie putt, but uh, hopefully we can uh, we can do it. I hope you guys can see the ball back there. Throw it. Yeah. This is a downhill sweeping putt to the to the left. Mike's got to have a nice touch for this putt. Maybe I should use the St. Nine for this putt. You might you might be better off. Like I said, you gotta go way up there.
playing that one. Get in the hole! Get in the hole! Oh. That's all you had to do. That's what I said originally. I said I had to go way up here. All right, guys. Cancer the par. See if the old man put it in. We're playing four holes. I just want to say Mike made a great putt. I guess what ball he used? The Saint Nine. Nine. You know why I used the Saint Nine, guys? Softer. Better Softer, better. and it was going downhill. If I was to use a top flight on that, yeah. I will agree that Saint Nine is an overall better ball, much better ball on top flight. The only reason why I use the top flight is just I just like hitting the ball far off the drive. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. Even after three, so. We're gonna add a fourth. We're gonna do a fourth hole or a different challenge. Do a fourth hole. Do a fourth hole. Do a fourth hole. Part five. Yep. All right, guys. Old man's up. You're hitting the Titleist driver. Titleist driver. Gonna see you take it off the bunker. I can't. I think I can carry that bunker. Part but I did. Five. I did. I did carry the bunker last time, though. Yeah. Part five. Four hundred and eighty-nine yards. Let's see if I can carry that bunker. If we can't carry the bunker. We'll hit out of the bunker. We carried it last time. Yeah. yeah. Hold on. Get the camera. All right, you're good. All right, he's on. He's live, baby. Nice. Uh, it's to the right, but that's okay. We'll play that. That's going to be okay. That is terrible. That is absolutely That's okay. We're, we're okay. <laughs> I came out of that a little bit, but we're okay. It's a part five. Hey guys, walking up here now, approaching my dad's shot. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, great. Terrible shot. It is where we got to make a great shot here. got to slice it. It might be okay. Not bad though, it's still in play. Got some trees in front of me, in front of me. Got the good distance. <laughs> oh. Nah, I'm trying to keep this low too. Tough shot here, guys. I killed that though, huh? Yeah. There we go. That's a nice shot. Yeah, that's a nice shot. Yeah, that's perfect. That's perfect, yeah. Good playing. Alright guys. Hopefully the Alright guys, you're approaching my bar right now. This is 150 marks, so I'd say about 100 yards to the green. What do you think? Oh, about well, 120, I think. Nah, Got a strong wind against us. I know guys can hear that in the mic, but it's a pretty strong wind. Yeah, it's about 20 yards up. Alright guys, real good. Got a really good opportunity here to uh, get, on, get on a green. Where's the 100 yard marker? Oh, right here. 110. Where's one? Oh, yeah, Mark. Okay, yeah, okay, 110. Okay. All right, I'm gonna hit a nine iron. Nine iron pins in the middle. In the back of a hole, hit an eight. There you go. That's the one. That's the one in the bunker. Wah, wah, wah. It's right next to the hole. Wah, wah, wah. Go look at it. All right, guys, Frank's in the bunker. Not in the bunker, I'm right next to the hole. You can't see, get glasses. Guys, thank God I brought my sand, my sand wedge with us today. Yeah. Frank's yeah. in the bunk. <laughs> Frank's next to the hole. Frank's in the bunk. All right, guys, walking up to the green. Um, left Mike a birdie putt, straight uphill, kind of shorter, but uh, he should uh, should make this. <laughs> should make it. Saint nine, I'm using the Saint nine. Going for the birdie pot. Watch, it's gonna go in. I'm using the Saint nine. Get in the hole. Get in the hole. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> what did I tell you? No, oh, that's why. I used to tell you, Michael, Saint nine's a better ball. He made a birdie <laughs> pot with it. You know what, guys? I don't even want that birdie. I didn't make it with a top flight. But All I'll right, guys. It. Good, good putt. Wow, we finished one under on this challenge, Frank. We did. We did. Good job. That's it's getting dark now, guys, so we're going to end it because uh, we lose golf balls now. We lose golf balls. So now we're going to play for fun and film. Just the film. The only way we'll film is we 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 film because if we're playing a part three, we make a hole in one. That's it. Don't, then we'll show that, but I don't think that's going to happen. But anyways. Uh, Boom, baby. All right, guys. Really happy. We did alternate shot, and not going to lie, on the way here, we both expected to shoot over par. Yeah, alternate shots are very difficult. Very difficult. They're a very difficult format. And we don't, we don't know if we did it right. We did play by the rules, maybe, because we don't really know the rules. We're changing. I was using the ball that I like. Mike was using the ball he yeah, liked. We're not PGA. Yeah, we, you know, we're here to have fun. We're having fun. We're, we're having fun. We did, the, we did right. play by the, by the basic rules. Yeah. So um, we we're very pleased with the round. Yeah, very pleased. You know, if we did this in the beginning of the year, we'd probably be up plus 10. <laughs> right now, we're, we are actually playing our best golf we've played all year, I would say. 
Oh, we're hitting the ball well. We're hitting the ball well, yeah? Very well. A lot better than the beginning of your guys. Yeah. So, you know what's um, nice is that we're out here now, there's nobody on the course. No one on the course There's less all. pressure. When you're, when you're filming, Yes. and yes. there's people on the course, it's just, it's it's torture at times. You got people behind you, you people in front, front of you. You, you, try, you want to impede anybody's play, but now we're out there and we're the only ones on the course. It's getting dark and stuff, but that's, it's a lot more enjoyable to film and play golf when there's not many people on the course. That's what I think what, one reason why we're playing so, I would so agree good. With him. I would agree with him greatly on that because we get stressed out when there's people behind us. But you know what, guys? We had a great day today. Once again, me and my dad made a great team. We support each other. We had fun again. Uh, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Once you get a thousand subscribers, we're going to pick one lucky winner. We have a great prize for you guys. And also have a great night. Anything else? Have a good night. All right, guys. Have a good one.